How's it going guys? Welcome to Minimize Media. I'm your host James. Welcome back to me in my granddad jump hat and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda The Ocarina of Time. I obviously you start every time you start at the, the Kokiri Forest. So I've cut that out and I've made my way all the way here. Into uh, we went up Zora's River because we want to get into Zora's domain. And one of the first things we need to do is stand on this little podium here in front of this lovely little waterfall. And, uh, ooh, there's a piece of heart there as well. Ooh, how do I get the piece of heart? I want to get that piece of heart. Can I just jump across? Taking a risk. Maybe not. So how do I... Ooh, I do... I can get you, though. Do they only come out at night? Ah. I wonder how many sculptures there are then for like um what's the sun song again? Let's 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 bat let's bow out the sun song again. Da, 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 da. Okay, do 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 Okay. Let's see if that sculpture reappears. I also want to get that piece of heart because I need it. Has that just made the sun come up? Yeah! Hmm, that's, that's, that's something to know. I wonder how many golden sculptures there are in the overworld then, in like the big field and stuff, in Hyrule Field. Hmm, I also need to visit the house in the Kakariko village because that's where I can, um... So how do I get that then? I need to know. Hmm. Cause it's 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 a fair old distance away that. Can't jump to it. I wonder if I could bring that chicken all the way here. Do you remember the chicken from the last episode? Look, we'll leave it for now because we get we get to come this way again soon. Because we need to make like a tree and leaf. But the first thing we want to do is... Um... We play the royal theme to be able to get in there because everything in Hyrule is connected to the royal family, obviously. So does everyone in Hyrule know the royal theme then? Is that how that works? Hmm. Either way, I'm going to come back later and bring that chicken and get that piece of heart. Because we used the chicken to get the other piece of heart last time. Zora's Domain. Ooh, the glittery music. Right, some stuff we need to do in here first. Uh, we have got a dungeon coming up. But some stuff we need to do. Uh, you'll notice that my money's a bit low, if you can even see it. Um, I did buy some seeds from Matey Boy for when we see uh, seed seed areas, some seedy areas, if you know what I'm saying. So I, and now I do need to build my rupees back up. I think getting sculptures is the way to build back your, um, to, to build up your, your max rupee capacity. Excuse me, I got this nose. Ah! Um, there is a shop here. Let's go to the shop real quick. Real quick. Hello, Zora's shop. Willkommen. Okay, 200 rupees, just caught, so fresh. I don't need to do that because we'll be able to catch our own fish soon. You will see. Ah, the Zorus tunic. 300 rupees, my goodness. I can barely hold 99 of these buggers. <laughs> okay, that's cool. That's fine. That's good. See, I'm already building back the, uh, the rupees, so... Let's talk to a Zora because they look awesome, don't they? Who are you? We are the Zora, the proud aquatic people. So, you have some connection with Hyrule's royal family. Well, what do you want from us? 
I'm here to save the world. Or just Hyrule, I'm not too sure. A bit sketchy on that. I might save the world after I've saved Hyrule, you know? Prior you got to prioritise in this kind of thing. What am I on about? <laughs> Any road. Um, there's a thing we need to do first. There's a thing we need to do. So if you see there... Let's talk to him first. Oh, my, my dear sweet Princess Ruto, where have you gone? I'm so worried. He would definitely talk with that sort of red cheek, wouldn't he? Whatever that is. Anyway, there's a game here that I want to play. How's it going, bruh? Diving game, 20 rupees. But we do need to play this. Pick up all the rupees I throw from here. You have only a limited amount of time. When you pick them all up, come back here and I'll give you something nice. Okay, how many are there? There's like five. Start! Sound. And dive again. Right, just concentrate and making sure I don't screw this up. Which I'm not going to. Do, do, do. There you go. We need that. And I'll tell you why. Oh, hello. How's it going? Um, which way am I going? I'm going that way. Because that'll lead us up and around. That's giving me more rupees, if anything. He, uh, that's like saying, pay me 20 quid to get up to this thing, and then in order to win it, you have to get 40 quid. <laughs> or whatever I'm trying to say. You know what I'm trying to say. You're smart. You're smart enough to see through that I am dumb. Right, I need the rupees now, so now I'm now I'm smashing pots with extreme bridge of this. Right, up we go. Um, I think we have to show the note to our big belly boy there. So uh, I'll be back with you in a minute. I'll be, I'll be with you in a minute. I'm just doing a thing, a side quest thing. What's up, bro? Okay. Ooh, oh my god, we're in the water, so the thing is wobbly wobbly. What a graceful dive. Now, please take this. It is a scale of our of our kind. With this, you can dive much deeper under the water. That's why we needed to do that. Very important. You got the silver scale. Jump into the water and press A. You can dive deeper than you could before. Oh yes! Oh rather, that is good. Right, uh, now. We want to speak to the lad here. Right? We actually want to, uh, get... I think, I think it's the note. Pretty sure, anyway. Yes. No? Hmm. I forgot what we do. I'm sure we show him the note. Let's go up by his big fat bum and let's see what happens if I present the note. Do I play the do I play the tune? Hmm, I, I might I, I might need to play Zelda's little bit. I'm sure you give him the note. I'm remembering that wrong, as is the case. Yeah. Play the song? It didn't come up with a prompt. It didn't come up with the, the staff along the bottom, which it normally does. Okay. I'm sure that's what we do, though. Hmm. 
Hmm. I need to remember what to do. I'm just standing in the wrong place. I can't remember what it is. I'm, I was sure that you're supposed to show him the letter. I've tried standing in different positions. But I'm going to go and do something else anyway. Because now we've got uh, more of a diving ability. If you see there, I know the graphics are a bit murky because I'm playing on the original hardware. But you'll see that there was a door. So let's rock down to Electric Avenue. And no, I want to go in there, Link. What are you doing? Although your name's not Link in this, it's Jim. Go, 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 go. There you go. Aha! Lake Hylia. And see if you have a look down there. I know you get a bottle from it. Are you supposed to do this for, for Princess Ruto? For the, uh, for the... The big chongy boy. It's that letter you show him, isn't there? Ah, 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 ah. I remember. I remember. I know how to do stuff. Why am I not collecting it? Go down. There you go. Cool, you got an empty bottle, but something inside. Press C to use. What something what? Something's already inside? Okay, cool. Um There's a couple of things we can do around here, but I think I might do Jabu Jabu first. I think. Maybe. Let's get to land first. I see land. Land a hoe! We're gonna uh because I I kinda wanna do that first. Don't know if I should or not. Or I should pot around Lake Hylia for a bit. Because there's stuff you can do. There's fishing. We can do some fishing. Because you all, all you all know that you came to this channel to watch me do some pretend fishing in an RPG. Otherwise, why would you be watching Zelda? Um, I know somewhere there is a sculpture somewhere. Is our big birdie friend there? Oh, go away, you. I'm not playing with you today. Um, so inside that bottle I, I, is the notes. Okay, so I'm showing him the wrong note. That's the problem. That's the problemo. Hey, fam. Okay. What are you doing? You've come a long way to get up here. You should look at the map. Subscreen sometimes. Jim, this is a beautiful lake full of pure, clear water. At the lake's bottom, there is a water temple used to worship the water spirits. The Zoras are guardians of the temple. <laughs> the Zoras come from Zora's domain in the northeast Hyrule. I know, I've just come from there. Aquatic race, blah, blah, blah. Royal family, blah, blah, blah. I heard that only the royal family of Hyrule can enter Zora's domain. <laughs> I had to go to Zora's domain to get here, you stupid owl. I'm on my way back to the castle if you want to come with me. No! No, no, no! I don't want to go back to the castle. Go away. You better not be following me to take me back to the castle. I don't want to go back to the castle. I hear flappery. Um, anyway, where was the entrance again? I'm completely turned around now. I think it's down there. To Zora's Domain. Yeah, I think it's down there. Okay. So, I want to show him the letter, and I kind of want to do this dungeon uh, in this episode. And then we will... Um, do some potting around in the next episode, maybe. We'll see how it goes, because I, I don't know how things are going to go. I don't know why I've prematurely dived here. This is fine, though. Because I collected one rupee. Thank God for that, eh? There you go. Water temple, you say. In you go, Link. Oh, for goodness sake. Nope. In we go. Go, go, go. Back into Zora's domain. Sweet. Because I don't think I don't think um, things get 
blocked off if you don't do them in time. Apart from a certain big bit, which, I mean, you'll find out very soon. Which you probably already know, so I don't even know why I'm mentioning stuff and things. Oh, see, I've already got back up to 60 rupees. I'm good, yo. Hold, only being hold, only being able to hold 99 rupees is annoying at the very beginning of this. Mostly because you collect rupees pointlessly. Anyway. What's up, blubber butt? First thing I want to do is equip the uh, message in a bottle. Okay. There you go. So it was showing my letter, but it's a different letter. Ooh, this letter. It's from Princess Ruto. Hmm. Let's see. She's inside, Lord Jabu Jabu. That's not possible. Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear Princess Ruto. Well, since that stranger Ganondorf hmm, gets about him, doesn't he? Came here. Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. The evidence seems clear, of course. You'll go and find Ruto. You can pass through here by the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu. Are you ready? Are you ready for this shuffling? Are you ready? I'll keep this letter. You keep the bottle. Yes. Bottles are handy. Please find my dear Prince of Sultan. So how are you guys doing? You, you doing alright? Meep. 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 <laughs> why, why? Why am I watching this? God, it's excruciating, isn't it? <clears throat> Are those carpets underneath the water? Are they not completely sodden and destroyed? Ah, all oh, right, he's done, he's done. We can finally go. Yay. Yay for me. Right. If you'll excuse me, I got me a princess to save. And I'm not even Super Mario. I'm the other Nintendo thing. Zora's Fountain. Oh, see him. He's one big boy. One scaly boy. Okay. It's pretty, um, it's pretty dark on the, the thing. Alright, so... We need you to open up your big gob. Look at the size of him. Let's try and get a look. God! Do you know, I never actually look, looked at him properly. He does have a crown. Okay, so we open one of these. I think it's one of these. And there's something inside of it. Right? No. Hmm. Essentially what we're doing is I want him to get op to open his mouth so we can go inside of him, God of War style. Because uh, the, the only way we can open the the only way we can open his mouth is presenting him with some yummy, giving him a yummy fish, right? I just need to find how you get a yummy fish because I can't quite remember now. Hmm. I know there are sculptures and things I can get from here, so. Maybe I should make it night and listen for some scratching. Maybe. How do you get a fish again? I swear it was in one of those bottles. Again, uh, because, like. This is quite an old game, I've played it loads and loads, but it, you still remember things intermittently, don't you? Hmm. I can't remember. Don't hit me with your scale. Ugh! What happened? The game glitched out. I can't use the bottle in the water. And it's like, give me a minute. I just need to remember how to get a fish. You're supposed to get a fish. 
Right, so I was deadly certain for some reason that you could catch a fish just in a bottle, just grab one up. I'm sure one came out of one of those pots. I might be misremembering it, I'm not too sure. But one of the things that I mentioned earlier is there is a fishing mini game. So I wasn't going to bog this episode down with it, but I think we're supposed to go fishing. Again, there's a lot of bits I'm going to misremember. There's a lot of bits I do completely remember. You're not going to remember everything about a game. Do you know what I mean? Especially a game this old. Do you know what I mean? 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 Anyway, let's do some fishing. Well, do you want to go fishing for 20 rupees? I'll go fishing for 20 rupees. As in, I go fishing and then you give me 20 rupees. You don't have a rumble pack. With a rumble pack, you... Ah, fish on the hook. This time, no rumble for you. Okay, listen up. I haven't got a rumble pack. I've got a memory card thing. I think I've got a rumble pack somewhere. Um, we'll go to the water and do a thing. Yep. While looking at the fish, you can cast your line with B and press A to break the line. When the lure drops into the water, you can wiggle it with the wiggly wiggly. You're going... If you're a novice, you can also use B. Reel in your lure with A and hold down A and R to reel in the thing. If you feel a hit, press A and down. This is... I mean, I guess I'll work it out. Walk up to the water's edge and press Z to hook a fish. Cast your line. Yeah, I got it. Okay, I should be, I should be fine. Let's go, let's just go, let's just go. How hard could it be? Right. Right. Come on, fishies. I can't see any fishies anywhere. Okay, and maybe I should have read the tutorial properly. <laughs> I think the fishy, fishy, fishies are mostly around the uh, bits with like wooden stuff. Okay. Right, come on, fish. You know you want to bite. You know you want to bite. Ooh. Come on, then. It's supposed to go down, right? Doesn't the law sink? Isn't the law supposed to sink? I feel, I feel like the law should be sinking, but it's just on it's just staying on top. Ooh, ooh! Ooh, ooh, ooh! Real! Come on! I gotcha! I gotcha! Come on! I was like waiting for it! I was like waiting for it! Oh come on! I'm pulling back on the control! Oh. Hey, what happened? You lost it? Damn! Right, okay, so it doesn't sink. Link, what are you doing? Are you officially an idiot? Okay, so it doesn't sink. I just need to get a bit more lucky. That would have been nice if we could have got that then. Damn you all to hell! <laughs> right, come on, fishies. Where you at? Ooh. I see you. Ooh. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. I'm holding back. I'm, I'm doing everything. I'm doing the stuff. I'm doing the stuff. Just, just, just pull you in. Come on. You stupid fish. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Come on. I'm pretty sure real fishing is not this difficult. Must be getting close. Must be getting close. Why is it battle music? Am I battling with this fish? Is that what's happening? Run. In you come, in you come. Ah, oh, gotcha, yes! Is it a big one? Wow, this is a real lurker. Let's see. 
It weighs 10 pounds. Do you want to keep it? Yeah. Hey. Stop saying hey at me. Okay. Let's see if that does a thing. I know if you get a real good one, he, uh, he gives you something good. What do you want? Weigh my fish. Whoa! This fish is huge. It looks like a new record. It weighs at least 10 pounds. Seriously. Okay, here's your prize. Oh, nice! Piece of heart. Love that. And I think we get to keep the fish, right? Do we not get to keep the fish? We don't get to keep the fish. Which means I have to get another fish. Hmm. I don't like that. So I need to keep it on my bottle. Did get a piece of heart though. That's not bad. Right, come on fishies. Where are you? Right, I've got another one. I've got another one. I've got another one. He's only a little one. He's only a little one. Let's pull in because I like doing this. It makes me feel like a man. Come on, come on, come on. In you come, in you come. Let's be having you. I need a fish, I need a fish, I need a fish, I need a fish. Okay, you're only a little pilchardy boy. Well, well, it's about two pounds. Do you want to keep it? Yes. Do I? I'm missing something here. I'm supposed to be getting a fish for Lord Jabu Jabu and it's not happening. Because the fish isn't in the bottle, so... Where's the fish? Why am I having such difficulty catching a fish? Right, I think I've done. I need to... I am sure you catch one in a bottle. Anyway, we've got to do the fishing mini game, which is good. Which, um... I want to quit, okay. So that's not too bad. We got to do the fishy mini bit game, which is which is fun, which is fun. That's the whole point of this game, is to do little bits like that. I might continue doing little bits then and maybe do Jabu Jabu in the next one. I kinda wanted to do Jabu Jabu in this episode. But tis not to be. So uh there is another thing around here which we can get. So uh there should be a scarecrow somewhere. Yeah, he's across the way there. Let's go to the Scarecrow because there's a thing you can do and there's a thing you need for the Scarecrow, which is super important. Here we are. What's up, bro? Okay. I am Bonuru, the Scarecrow musical genius. I hear a song once and I never forget it, baby. Oh, you have an ocarina. Hey, why don't you lay down a tune on me with it, baby? So, let's... That was an alright tune, wasn't it? Well, not bad. I will remember it for you anyway. I don't mean I can remember only eight notes, but let's just cut it right there for now. So, that's now my song for my Scarecrow. See? I think I did alright. I think that's a nice little note. But we are going to need that, because there are parts in the game where you absolutely 100% need scarecrows for stuff. Um, let's go up to this house over here. Might as well get some little stuff done while we're here, because I don't think I'm going to fit Jabu Jabu in this episode. I don't want the episode to be like an hour and a half, two hours long. Ooh, there's a seed thing here. Do I want to put the seeds in? kind of do. There's not something else you could put in them. There's something else you could put in them. Like... Like bugs or something. Isn't there bugs you can get? Can you not pick up bugs? Yeah! Come here, you! Yeah! I, I instinctually remembered and just went over to that to get some bugs. The bugs, are bu bugs in the bottle. You can release them by pressing this button. Do 
you put them in? I'm sure you put them in the little hole. If not, I'll put a seed in there anyway, so it doesn't matter. But I kind of want to go into that, that shack anyway. And... Because I can't strictly remember... I think I know what's in there. I think. Let's give this a try. Thump. There we go. Ah, there was a bottle of boo, so... See, one went in there. Well, they all went in there. It's a sculptula. Excellent. I will take that. You destroyed a golden sculptula. I think I just remembered how to increase stuff. You get the tokens, you take the tokens to the house in the Kakarika village. There's another Sculptula somewhere around here. I don't even know how many Sculptula tokens I have. Lakeside Laboratory. This guy's face is freaky, if I remember correctly. Yes. Hello there, son. My research... I'm researching the process of making a medicine by mixing Lake Hylian's water with various unusual compounds. Perhaps you've met an old lady from the potion shop. She's like a student of mine, have I? Maybe? <laughs> I haven't met no one, leave me alone. Strange old man. The music in this bit is weird. Oh, there is something there. Is that a red rupee? That'll come in handy. Oh, come on. Ah, never mind. We'll leave it for now. I'm sure there's another sculpture somewhere around here. I'm going to get as many as I can because I want all the stuff and all the good things. There should be... Yeah, there's a little lonely island over there. The lonely island. Oh, I could have done your cool dive, Link. Jeez. Show off a little bit, do you know what I mean? And then we'll head back to Zora's Domain, because I'm sure, like, I'm still sure that you catch a fish in a bottle. I'm still sure that that's a thing. Oh, I'm not even going to need to play the sun song, because the sun's going down. Me putting up into the real sky, or my ceiling. You know what I mean? But yeah, uh, now that I know that the sculpture has only come out at night, again, like my grandma's teeth, that's that's intriguing. So sometimes it might be best to roam around at night to get stuff. I'm sure there's a sculpture here. Yes! Boom. I wonder if it shows me how many I got. Eight. I see it there, look. Uh, no, I don't want to save yet. Anyway, I want to... What's the plan now? Head back to Zora's Domain? Maybe? What's at the top of here again? I cannot remember. So that's the way we're going. We're going to play the sun songs, bring the sun back up. No, we're not. Just in case there's a sculpture, which is what I just said. You idiot. Unless that just takes me across to the top there so I don't have to swim around. I definitely don't want to talk to the owl boy. Right. Just putting this out there so you guys can agree or disagree, whatever. Uh, yeah, that just takes me back up to the top there. Um, I think the owl is way more annoying than Navi. I think his exposition dumps are just... Oh, oh, ah! How do I get you, though? Can I collect it with a... How do I get you? I have, I'm going to get a device soon that's going to help me get that, so maybe I should have left it. Oh, the sun's coming up already. Jeez Louise. Um, can I put... 
I see you didn't hear anyway. That's probably saw you didn't there anyway. I saw you'd. I don't know why I said it like that. Yeah. Because, oh, I just spat all over my mic. Anyway, I'm headed back to Zora's domain. Because... Why not? I need to find out where you get a fish. I need to find out where you get a fish. Because it's bugging me now, because I'm an idiot. Most- mostly. Right, I'm not gonna go in on this dive. <sighs> Some things later on that you get that just make just going around water so much easier. Water's not exactly a strong point in, um... in Zelda games. <laughs> Right, fish. I must find a fish. Hunt for a fish. Because I need it in my life to get past the jabu 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 jabu. Right. So you need them in shallow the shallow water around here. Let me get my um Let me get my bottle ready just in case. Because it's either It's either around here or it is around Jabu Jabu that you get fish. Oh, there's fish there! Did you get it from here, you idiot? Ugh. What a colossal... Colossal idiot. I could have been doing it all this time. Damn it! Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh, God. Excuse me. Oh, sent me into the twilight zone, that sent me into the fifth dimension. Anyway, let's get up and have a word with, with, with Jabu Jabu. And then, uh, do you know what, actually? Now that I've got the fish, I'm going to leave this episode here. Nothing too crazy to shout home about in this episode. Uh, we did do the fishing minigame, which was really cool. We got to see uh, Lake Hylia for the first time. We got a couple of Sculptula tokens. I think if you get 10, I think it's if you get 10, you get something cool. And then, or it might be 5, then 10, then 15. I can't remember specifically. But um, in the next episode, we will be going inside Jabba Jabba's belly and sorting that dude out and giving him a good inside exam, rectal exam, if you will, because we need to save Princess Ruto, who is inside Jabu Jabu, and you will find out why he's inside Jabu Jabu. But more importantly than that, we get an item inside of him that is super important for the rest of the game. Very, very important. In fact, it's one of the most iconic um, items that you can get in a Zelda game. So that's what we'll be doing next time. Uh, we did do the diving mini game, which gave us more diving power, which is definitely good. And, uh, yeah, again, this is one of those episodes where I'm just potting around. I did want to go inside the belly today, but just was not meant to be, because I had to do all the faffing about bit first. But next time, Jabba Jabba's belly, stabbing all the organs, killing stuff, and doing dungeon and stuff. Anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, then please support the channel by hitting the subscribe button, then click the notification bell, spread the word, and always remember to take it easy.